West Pier was a Victorian pier and the most elegant of seaside piers located on western end of Brighton, designed by architect Eugenius Birch and built in 1866. The pier was considered one of the most advanced piers of its time with a concert hall, tea rooms and the theatre, all added later after 1890s. Initially the pier had only two square kiosks at the entrance and a more octagonal kiosk in the centre and at the end of the platform and the structure was illuminated at night. West Pier slowly became a popular destination for visitors to Brighton, attracting millions of visitors each year. West Pier was one of the oldest surviving piers in England and was considered an important example of Victorian seaside architecture. Now we are in 1903 when the pavilion was converted into the theatre and the final building completed in 1916 on the pier was a graceful concert hall. An interesting thing is that West Pier became so popular that it was recorded that in 1919 the pier experienced the highest number of paying visitors, over 2 million. Between the wars, the pier was used by day trippers traveling to and from France. And when the pier reopened after the Second World War in 1945, the theater was converted into an amusement arcade. However, soon after, in 1975, the pier was closed for safety and further reasons. First of all, the pier was over 100 years old at the time and had begun to break due to the weather. Secondly, the cost of maintaining and repairing the pier had become so high that the owners were unable to keep up with, uh, with the expenses. The third, the pier was no longer attracting enough visitors to cover its operating costs. And finally, the safety of the pier had become a concern and it was considered unsafe for public. The factors of closing West Pier in 1975, which I mentioned in my previous video, led finally to its closure until 2003. Despite the fact of its slow fall, the government recognized the pier's merit by changing its listing from Grade 2 to Grade 1 in 1982. Essential renovations finally began in 1986 and a small section of decking was reopened. However, the process of restorations was very slow and the hope for people who loved West Pier to see its beauty again faded after several years. Because when the storm in December 2002 hit the coast, it caused a walk away with the concert hall to fall into the sea. And it's now 28th of March 2003, around 9.50 a.m. when the fire brigade received a call reporting the West Pier was on fire. Sadly, the forces were not able to put down the fire due to the damaged walkway, low tide and obstacles from the structure laying in the water. And the reason to blame for fire was a suspicious arson attack by a speedy boat. I'll also share a link to a video from this tragic moment in the comment section, which you can watch on YouTube. Nowadays, West Pier is in local people's hearts and is considered one of the most picturesque beauties on the Brighton seafront.